Cao Yun and his allies arrived in Chengdu, following a lead that suggested this was where Liu Bei was being held. Upon their arrival, however, they were shocked to see that Chengdu Castle was under heavy attack from Yukimura Sanada, himself supposedly a member of the resistance against Orochi. Yukimura had been tricked into believing that the soldiers of the army inside Chengdu Castle were the spirits of the dead, revived by Orochi's necromancy. Under siege, it was only a matter of time before the Chengdu army would be wiped out. To defend his lord trapped within the castle, Zhao Yun took up the fight against Yukimura. I checked Chengdu out. The castle's under heavy guard and the sentries are seriously on edge. They may as well have a sign out front letting us know who they've got in there. Thank you for your efforts. Right, we must advance upon Chengdu and rescue my lord.
victory is mine!
Continue our search together. Wait, Lord Xiao Yun, you must allow me to apologize for my foolishness. No apology necessary. I would have done the same had I been in your position. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Apparently some of Da Ji's forces were in your army and the army at Chengdu. They were probably trying to create dissension in the ranks. That woman's a real terror. Daji must have wanted rid of us both badly. My lord, allow me to join your army. I would be a fool to turn down an offer from one so talented. With you at my side, I am afraid of no one. I hate to break up this touching scene, but Daji's headed south. Are we following or what? Chase Daji! Fuck! You speak wisely, my ineloquent friend. We must chase Daji. Maybe she will lead us to my lord. <laughs> <laughs> 